Hello, Steve Hall here. This time I've got a bass, and I'm going to show you a little bit about how I get around the bass. This is bass is a Spectre, which is a pretty nice five string bass that I've got, and I started with four, but now I'm on five. That low B string gives you a nice. Okay. Um, similar to when I was talking about guitar, I use the bass technique on my top fingers here to, to my right hand to move around to strum. And there's various people like Victor Wooten that have technique where they double up. They're doing like a thing with their thumb, you know, doubling that way. Um, there's people that use multiple fingers like that. Yeah, on the string, combinations. I think Victor does a combination where he does that as well as this, so he gets going really fast. We can do some of that. At the moment, I'm just going to use a standard technique where I'm moving my fingers around like that. I sometimes rest it on a string, and then yeah, there's an exercise that I do that I show you. That my friend John taught me. I just get a like a two and a, like a fifth going here, right? So. Got, got a fifth here, go two strings like that, and then on this side I'm just doing a, I'm actually alternating that bass note, now I'm using this finger to get the bass note, now I'm alternating with that finger, so really I'm just alternating. Slapping, that's another reason that I got one of these things is to slap. I'm just gonna move this over. If you're slapping, what I'm doing there, and there's a lot of different ways to do this, but I'm just brushing my thumb in front of the string, and then grab another, you can use it various fingers, but I got my pointy finger there for, for the pluck. jazz playing, so it's something over here, what I'm doing over here is I'm, I'm doing a, like a, a ghost, so I'm like a, it's like a little graceful thing I'm doing, let me check this out, so, so what I'm doing is I'm letting go the string, and I'm doing a like dotted eighth note thing, so. Graham is 
there's a lot of people that do this sort of thing. And you have to have your bass turned right up. And you do a... I try not to keep too busy because my tendency is to treat this like guitar, trumpet, or anything else where I play too many notes. And you know, what you really want to do, the good players will be you know, laying back, they know when to, to blend into the groove. Like, you know. fifths a lot. 